Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am sharing with you one of the new Today's Special Value from QVC. It is the new It Cosmetics set. I got it. I am so happy to have it and I want to tell you all about it. I got this the other day when I got back from vacation and it is such a big box. I don't fit in it really, but it shows you everything. It comes with a book that lets you know everything about what's in here, what it does, why it does, how to use it. So I really always love that about it cosmetics. They're always very user friendly. There's never a question of how to use something or whether or not somebody who's new to makeup could use these products. You always can. So everything that comes in here looks like this. It's all in the very nice safe container. I'm going to show you a demonstration of a few of the, or everything that I use today. I'm going to show you a demonstration of, so don't worry. You will see everything in action, but I just wanted to talk about a few of the things that come in in here. Or three of the things are brand new launches in here. One of them is the Bye Bye Pores Blush. It comes in the cute little silver box. Her normal black, lovely, sleek packaging. This is in Naturally Pretty. This is actually to help. It has like a very slight illumination. Not much to it at all, but it's very subtle. It's beautiful. I have it on today, and I love it. It's like a perfect color for anybody, I think. Unless you are very dark skin tone, you might have to use um, a couple more rounds of it. But it's a little goes a long way user friendly it looks beautiful it has a very subtle illumination nothing too crazy to it love this so much so i just wanted to show you what it looks like up close in person just a beautiful beautiful blush i love her blushes this one helping with the pores as well as giving you flawless looking beautiful glowed skin love okay, next is new to me but it is not new to her line this is the bye bye pores pressed i have the bye bye pores in the loose powder i love it it does have a lot of kickback um because of its consistency it's very light but I have always wanted to try it in the press version and I haven't done it yet, so I'm glad that this came in the kit as well. It's a translucent thing, so it doesn't change the color of your skin. It really just puts this like nice, even layer on your skin. It's just a wonderful product. I love it so much. It just blurs your imperfections, just kind of sets everything nicely. I did use it to set my under eyes and my face today. So this has always been a big hit and I love having it in the press version. Um, definitely just tap your brush off a little bit because it does have a little bit of a dust to it and sometimes it can just choke you up inside. Okay, next thing that is brand new as well, I already love the Bye Bye Under Eye. You guys have heard me talk about it before. I've talked about the regular version and the waterproof version. Now she has it in an illumination version and I love it. Besides the packaging being so stinking cute, it's like a pearly light pink with silver accents. It's adorable. I love it. This um, is in the color medium and even for me, I found that it worked perfectly. My skin's a little bit um, more fair right now not um, like porcelain fair but I would say light right now and it worked perfectly on me it does give a very nice illumination to it I did not do two coats this is just one um, in a light coating at that you could definitely do two and get even more full coverage I um, I did talk about it in the video that it just has a little bit left of the blue you can still see in person um, so I probably would use like a peachy concealer underneath if you wanted to do a light washing of it or you could just do a thicker version of, or a thicker layer and get more coverage. But it had great coverage. It has a beautiful illumination to it without being like, whoa, you put highlighter under your eyes, lady. It looks really beautiful and natural and I'm very happy with it. Another launch brand new to this is this amazing brush. This is her Bye Bye Pores brush. She's um, come out with so many beautiful brushes, but never one specifically pertaining to a product. This is the pores one. It's a little dirty just because I just used it in setting my foundation and stuff. But the packaging is gorgeous. It's got a beautiful silver handle with a white little decal. It's a beautiful, just like fluffy white domed cloud. It's perfect. I used it all over today to set my face. Um, I did not use it to set my under eye because it's just a little too big. I used something else, but 
to set my face. It was amazing. I love this so much. It's just, it's so soft. I can't even tell you how soft this is. And I'm very, very pleased okay. to have it. Last but not least, I'm going to show you a screenshot of it because I didn't, you can't demonstrate it on camera as well, but I did it the other night. This is the Bye Bye Makeup 3-in-1 Makeup Melting Cleansing Balm skin softening serum concentrate as you know she does everything with skincare in mind first then the makeup part so i love that she's been coming out with so much skincare lately i have not tried the moisturizer i've heard great things but the, she works with plastic surgeons to get all of her stuff done and it's always amazing this did not disappoint at all this is 2.82 ounces. It just says you gently massage onto dry skin, rinse well with warm water, wipe off with a face cloth, and pat dry. Skin is left feeling soft, supple, and moisturized. For deeper, clean, and intense hydration, leave on for 60 seconds. I definitely enjoyed this a lot. It's just like you would think it is. It just looks like a bomb. It has a nice seal cover on there. I love that. Uh, but it looks just like this, just a nice balm. It's not too thick, not too thin. Um, I used a little bit of, I'm, I may have used a little bit too much, but I, I had a lot of makeup on that day. So it worked out well for me. It was nice. It didn't feel greasy at all. It felt just like a very nice cleanser, but it, it has the balm feel instead of like a soap feel. It came off really nicely. It took off my makeup on my eyes, including my mascara. I didn't have waterproof on that day, but um, I would just say that do everything first, and then maybe if you need just a little bit more on the mascara for your eye la for your eyes, just use a makeup remover for your eyes if you need to, or just use a little bit more of this. It felt so nice on the skin. It did leave my skin feeling hydrated, not stripped or dry. Um, you still want to, I still went in after and used a cleanser and stuff and cleaned my face a little bit more, but for removing your makeup, this was amazing. I really, really enjoyed the feel of this. I love the way it felt on my skin and I like that it didn't feel oily or greasy. It just felt like a nice, like, I don't know, it, it's so hard to describe, but it just felt really nice to take your makeup off it, with it without it feeling oily or greasy. So I am a big fan of this as well. Also, I wanted to throw in a few things recently I picked up. Um, it Cosmetics had their sale. Um, I picked this up a long time ago. I just have not demonstrated it for you, but I am wearing it today. This is their new skinny, super skinny brow power uh, pencil. I got mine in warm blonde. I... I like this, but I it's not as creamy as I thought it would be. It's a little bit more dry, but I had no problems putting it on. It just is a little bit more um, effort in how hard you want to push. But if you are really like, you like a light washing of it, this is perfect. So I did really enjoy this, and I got this from QVC as well because it's so much cheaper. You get, you get two of these for... With shipping and, and tax, it's thirty-one fifty-six, and I believe they're about twenty by themselves. It's eighteen or twenty. I'll list it somewhere around here. But I highly recommend getting it on QVC. You just get such a better deal when you're buying things like this. like this. It's really cute and sleek. I like the packaging. It just looks very classy. There is a spoolie on the end, and it's a very nice stiff spoolie, which I do enjoy that just to help spread that out and make it look really nice. But it does have a very nice fine tip point to it so that was really nice and I really like it but it, it is just a little bit more of a dry stiffer formula but it works good once you get it going on your eyebrows I don't find I didn't have any problem doing my eyebrows today okay so on to the sale that they have on their they had on their website they had a lot of things that I had already had but two things I had never picked up because I just did not pick them up. I don't know. I never wanted to fork over the money for them, but I knew that they would be so amazing. And of course, now that I finally picked this up, she has a brand new one coming out. Um, this is the face sculpting, my sculpted face. This has your bronzer, your highlighter, um, everything. It also has two mirrors. One is more close up so you can see. This has always gotten great reviews. I used a little bit of it today for the bronzer. I love it. It's really nice. Um, I'm excited to see how her new one plays, and I might have to pick up two. I don't know. I also picked up her Luxe High Performance Eyeshadow Palette. I have not picked... 
I hadn't picked this up yet, but I've been wanting it for so long. The case is cute. It's a little bulky and thick, but it has like a cute little padding cushion on it. Um, but I just wanted this for so long because I love all things it cosmetics really I haven't found very many things I haven't been pleased with but I do especially love the colors in here it does come with a little brush if you want but these are what the colors look like let me know down below if you haven't seen this and you want to see a review of it I'd love to do that for you but I just wanted to show you quickly with the it cosmetics stuff what I thought of it I'm going to read for you before I demonstrate it what the bye bye under eye illumination full coverage anti-aging concealer says so it says warm it on your hand like in swirling motion tap it on your eye and then blend for perfection so it says now with drops of light technology to brighten look of skin with a soft luminosity this full coverage anti-aging concealer helps visually camouflage the look of imperfections with pigments that never crease never crack and even have the appearance of your most flawless looking skin this comes in the color medium. I'll list all the information down below of other ones that it comes in. This packaging is really so cute. It looks a lot like the CC Illumination. Um, nice, pretty pink, like, like a pearly pink. And it also has silver accents. So I'm gonna put it on my hand. And uh, with all of my other Bye Bye Under Eye concealers, a little goes a long way. So I'm only gonna put just a little bit and see how it goes. I'm going to warm it on my hand and just kind of start working it on my hand a little bit and do as I said and tap it on. Yes, I just realized you should be using your ring finger. No, I am not, but I am being very gentle. And I don't have any concealer on, just foundation. And I am going to bring it down just a little bit like you would your regular concealer. So that is my beautiful face. <laughs> um, you can go as light or as heavy as you want. I just wanted to start with a thin layer first and see how it works. I am going to take my Beauty Blender. It is dirty already because I used it with my foundation, so don't judge me. Um... You could continue tapping your finger into it. I just like the effect of the Beauty Blender. You can definitely keep tapping your finger into it until it's completely spread out. I just enjoy the Beauty Blender tapping for me. I just think it does a really nice job. So that's with one eye done. Okay. So we are all tapped in. And like I said, I didn't do a super duper heavy coverage. But this is what it looks like. I think it looks really nicely illuminated like it says. Um, still see a little bit of darkness, but you could definitely do another layer and I'm sure that that would take care of it. Um, but Or maybe do your orange contouring first if you wanted to, to ha cover the darkness first, like a peachy or orange color to cover it first. And then okay, okay, now moving on to the Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder. I have the loose powder. I do not have the pressed and I have not set my foundation yet or my under eyes, which I always like to do because the Bye Bye P Under Eye Concealer is really wonderful, but it still leaves a little bit tacky, so I really do like to set it. So this says it makes your imperfections look like they've disappeared. You know, the Universal Silky Skin Loving Powder helps optically blur the look of imperfections. It just says swirl your custom cut Heavenly Skin Bye Bye Pores powder brush in a too compact and tap the brush. Tap brush gently onto the lid to remove excess powder. Then softly buff the powder onto your skin in circular motions for a smooth soft focus skin perfecting finish. It can be worn alone on bare skin or over makeup as a finishing touch. And it also says that you can put it on under your Bye Bye Illumination to give it just a little bit of uh, help to seal it in. Um, her normal black packaging with the writing on it. It does have a little protective cover. It does have a sponge. If you like sponges, um, I personally don't like them that much unless I'm on the go, but this is what it looks like. This is her brand new Bye Bye Pores Powder Brush. Um, I love how her brushes always come in a nice big container to give the brush a lot of room. It doesn't mess up the bristles or anything. This brush, I'm not kidding you guys, looks amazing. I haven't even tried it yet, but it looks amazing. So it has a very nice silver handle with a white little accent here. It says Bye Bye Pores Powder. It is so cool. I like, I love the uniqueness of this brush without even trying it so far. 
So it has this dome effect, but it's very domed. So it just looks like it's gonna be perfect for powdering and just touching up. And I'm not even kidding. When they say like heavenly luxe, it's because it's like luxury. It is so, so soft. Oh my gosh, it's so soft, you guys. Like it feels like you're just wiping like baby feathers on your skin if they feel amazing. I don't know, I've never wiped feathers on my skin. Okay, let's try this. So I'm just gonna swirl it in there. It, it does tend to get a little um, dusty and airy, so I do definitely suggest to tap off your brush so you can see there's like a little bit of stuff. But it's nothing that a normal powder doesn't do. I just like to definitely tap off my brush. So I'm gonna begin with my face and set my foundation because I haven't yet set my foundation. And I find that her powders just go on so smooth. They feel like like butter. They just feel so good. And um, they just really do help to just set a barrier on your face and just give you a very clean, polished finish. Okay, I'm gonna go in with kind of a beauty blender size kind of brush to go in under the under eyes with this. Just to set my concealer. I like to go in with one of my favorite setting brushes and um, it's from Real Techniques. It's the setting powder brush. It just sweeps so nicely under there and set all that powder. So the blush says, it says Bye Bye Pores Blush Airbrush Brightening Blush. It will make you blush. Smile and add blush. This is your sheer buildable silk infused blush that not only gives you a naturally pretty flush color that lasts, or that gives you a pretty fresh color that lasts. Uh, using your biggest smile, use your guide at Customly Heavenly Skin Bye Bye Pores Powder Brush. Sweep away your flush pink onto the apples of your cheeks. Use upward sweeping motions to give your skin a youthful color that stays put all day. Okay, so next we move on to our Bye Bye Pores blush. Now I have one of her um, Vitality uh, stain blushes and I love it. It's an amazing brush, super pigmented. I have the highlighting, the illumination blush um, from the CC line. I am excited to try this. Her black packaging, really cute and always sleek. This has a really interesting design on it and I really like it. It almost looks like a bunch of pores with the It Cosmetics logo on it as well. I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell. I'll give you a swatch. I got a long time ago at um, Bed Bath & Beyond. They have them, it's like, I forget the name, it's rubbed off, but it's really nice. I love this blush brush. So I'm just gonna tap it in there. Um, it does have a little bit of fallout, so definitely tap that off. And I kind of stipple it on first and then blend it out. So I love her blushes because they're very pigmented. A little goes a long way, and if this helps to even hide your pores even more, then that's even better in my opinion. So this is what it all looks like. I think I have a very fresh, dewy, nice looking skin without being like oily or greasy. It just, it looks really perfected in my opinion and it looked really good. So that is everything from It Cosmetics today. I hope you really enjoyed it and I will see you all in my next video. If you have any questions or want any more in-depth information on it, leave it down below and I will see you all later. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.